Right, we're back to part two. So, your, your registration in the D-Star system has been accepted. To obtain a call sign at a later date, you will need to reapply for a new registration. Fair enough. Your next step is to log back in here, dstar.org, and click the Personal Information tab. The first entry will enable you to use terminal mode in new radios, and they recommend that we do that. And it's saying that when, when I create the the space entry as described below enter a capital letter letter Z in the initial box and then click access point check box second entry click the check box next to the number two enter a single space by pressing the space bar once in the initial box do not check the access point box in the line Press the update button to save your changes. Your browser must have JavaScript enabled. Hopefully I have. Please note, you do not, if, if you do not complete the registration by adding at least one terminal within two weeks, reg registration will be removed. Right. So, okay, I've had another email from them as well. So I'm going to read that and then keep trying. Yeah, and it's a helpful email from Terry, one of the volunteers, that that's uh, just told me that yeah, it's not quite done yet, which I can, I can see that it's not. I need to complete the second step, otherwise, I won't have my two terminal. Where is it? If you don't check in your spam folder you have yet to create your terminals so there you are so it's important that we get this right okay so i've uh i've logged in with my new username and password i still don't know what to do yet but i've logged in okay so it's telling me to log in uh on go into the page I'll just minimize this and click on personal information so I'm going to do that okay this all these windows have come up okay okay so what I'm doing is it says first entry click the checkbox next to number one enter a capital letter Z so we'll click the checkbox next to one and we'll click a Z. And we've and we've done a, a capital Z as it said. And then click the access point checkbox. We've done that. Right. Second entry. Click the checkbox next to number two. As we've done. Enter a single space by pressing the space bar once in the initial box. Do not check the access point box in this line. Press the update button to save your changes. Click OK. OK. Click OK. I think I've done it. M0FXPZ. Please note, if you do not complete your registration by adding at least one terminal Within two weeks, your registration will be removed. Welcome to D-Star. So the next thing I'm going to be demonstrating is how to actually use this terminal mode. Now, just so you know, terminal mode is uh, on your ID 50 one plus 2. You use OPC 2350 cable. On the 52, I'm pretty sure you can do it with a normal micro USB. On the 705, you can do it with a normal micro USB. So hopefully we can get into some D stars and reflectors and things just by plugging straight into the computer. And I think, yeah, why not? It's fun. I know we've got a hotspot, but it's fun. So 7.3, this is, this is sort of like part two of the D star gateway system, um, which is actually, uh, I would say, enabling our gateway. 7.3, all the best.